Hi, I'm Karen from RT Systems, K0RTX, and there is an easier way to program that radio. The RT Systems programmers for your radio make it so much easier to set up receive and transmit frequency, offsets, tones, everything your radio needs for you to use it. The RT system software reflects your radio as it came to you out of the box. There is so much to today's radio. We have receive and transmit frequency, we have offsets, we have names, tone modes, different tone modes, banks. Radios just do so much these days. Other than what goes on in your memory channels, we also have behind the scenes settings that work that make your radio do all kinds of personalized things. So now we're going to input a memory channel. Let's do 147.240. I typed 147 period 240 and when I press enter, the program automatically knows that that's a plus offset. It knows that my operating mode will be FM. It knows everything about that. I don't have to worry about it. Now, if I want a name, I just go to that field and type it in. And when I want my tone mode, it's still two steps, but I have a mouse click and a drop down for tone, and a mouse click and a drop down for the value. That channel's ready to go to my radio. It's ready for my radio to use it. If I want to put in another one, let's put in 445250. That's a repeater in my area. It automatically knows it's a minus. It already knows it's a 500 megahertz or a 5 meg offset. Again, the name, this is Local 2. Won't let me put in too many characters. Tone mode, this one's Tone Squelch, let's say. And I come down and I pick the value. This radio will use the same value in and out. So now I have some memory channels ready to go to my radio, but I want to customize my radio a little bit. So I go to Settings, Radio Menu Settings, and I'm going to turn on TX Save, so the radio saves its battery a little bit. I'm going to turn the bell on three times so it rings on an incoming call. And I'm going to turn my lamp mode to five seconds so the lamp stays on for five seconds after I press a button. I then save this part of it because I won't have to do this again if I make another file. So I've set up my file now with all the memory channels that I wanted. I go to communication, send data to radio. The program tells you exactly what to do on the radio. To set up your radio for programming, you insert the cable with the radio off, hold the Monty T call and turn it on. You're in a startup menu. Turn it to the clone option and press the FW key. Now it's ready to program with the programmer and remember, all those instructions are on the screen. Just follow them carefully. When it verifies RX and you click OK, the bar fills and tells you that everything's ready to go to the radio. So we're loading this radio now with exactly what you see on the screen and what was in that settings file in the background. When the bar finishes filling, your radio is recorded, ready for you to disconnect it, take it to the field, and have fun with ham radio. So this is Karen. And remember, if you think you can or you think you can't, you're right. 73s.